what is best in life well today we join uh sheikah landon the cruel who is the head of lucifer's own but being head of this lucifer's own and also a cannibal and also homosexual not that there's anything wrong with that uh the caliph stripped him of all his titles and went to war with him and destroyed him and i am in response uh, going back to war to try to get my titles back. Uh, I did it with Alamut, and now I am attempting to do it to retrieve Gurgan, which has become independent. And uh, so I'm trying to restore Gurgan, my former capital, and I'm at war with the uh, Marzipate of Gurgan. And that's where we join the battle. So this should be a session of battling as often as I can, as much as I can. I'm losing 16 gold a month. I've hired these mercenaries. <laughs> there are snakes out there who can fell a grown man instantly with a single bite. Sure, I'll buy a snake. So I'm trying to uh, get back all these territories as quickly as I can, and the Hopefully, uh, uh, I've got Alamut next to the dad. And I have a son who's grown into maturity, even though he's slow. Young Shirin is an indulgent wastrel. Uh, it keeps getting me to torture all my uh, dungeon prisoners, so why not? And betrothed can marry. And I'll lay low as they caught another member of Lucifer's own. daughter to my old Mobad that should keep the old pervert happy. And I'm back up to 980 gold. I guess that's because I was able to uh, steal the wealth of Gurgan. And I guess there's another child lacking focus. Uh, learning, stewardship, diplomacy. I'll try learning for this one. Why not? And try to give a matrilineal marriage to keep my dynasty expanding. I have an 86% war score. suffer for now no earthly ailment is beyond the power of every man i'm preparing a great ritual to cleanse my body and become like new every man may take every man may give as the ritual is finished i can feel my strength returning to me purging the weakness that has been holding my body in a vice and uh does that mean i lose the fever it will be as every man desires and i yes i lose the trait fever and fatigue Yes, I guess I'll go torture another woman in my prison. Why not? Now, 
I'm still supposed to impregnate someone in my court. And I can't uh, recruit for Satan, and I can't unholy impregnation. I need her to be a member of the Devil Worshipper Society, and I've been able to uh, convince absolutely zero people to join the Satan's own. And I can't recruit for own because she's been that, and I can only approach them for approach each person once. It was a bit too enthusiastic torturing Jandahar. He died. Oh well, who will ever know? And uh, that's it for this war. And I've usurped Gagan. So let me just slow down the game a little bit, or a lot, and check which other provinces I can Galan. Seems independent. Uh, he's not independent, apparently, even though he looks independent. He's uh, for under the Caliph. Kazwin, the Emir of Galan. Border dispute over Kazwin. Lose 25 piety, lose 100 gold, and everyone in the Sune region is angry at me. Don't I have a claim uh, that I could pass? Dalem, Shirvan is the is held by the Caliph himself. Who is this schmuck? Can I? Why can't I declare war on him? I need a valid Casas belly, so I don't have claims on these places anymore. I thought I did automatically. My rival. Rivalry. It would cost me 521 prestige as a truth breaker, but it would be a border dispute as well. I thought I at least had claims on all my old properties. Oh, so glitter hoof, you've got to go, unfortunately, even though. Uh, demonic position of glitter hoof, offer him a concubine. Uh, I'll appoint him a commander, but then I will, I need a real chancellor. Fabricate a claim. Now here's Tabriz. The Caliph holds Tabriz as well. Hopefully he'll give up these low-level sheikdoms so I can take them back. But uh, Gurgan, Gurgan and Tabaristan. Actually, can I usurp? The Emirate of Tabaristan. Cannot usurp a title from anyone in the same realm unless you have a strong claim. And this is my rival, the Emir of Arabia, Emir of Tabaristan. Heir to the Harzbad Emirate. See what my plot to kill power does versus him versus tainted touch. I hate to be paying for these mercenaries without actually any fighting. Oh, it looks like his court is fairly uh, loyal to him. Oh no, there's someone who's joined. 49% and no one else will take a bribe to kill this old man. I guess I'll taint and touch him. Check how my dark power is doing. I still have 1200 left. And I wish there was a woman of my own house that I could impregnate, but I need to recruit one from Satan. from Satan first. 
Princess of Jaws. She's 66. I can't impregnate her. She's a prisoner in Corbier, and she's a member of my house. Uh, Declaim poetry. A attempt to abduct. Invite to court. Induct into Lucifer's own. Now, I will try demonic possession first to make her uh, pliable, and then I'll try to induct her into Lucifer's own. People are becoming suspicious of my use of the <coughs> Lucifer zone. Two weeks claims can be possessed. Uh, the sheikdom of Kabar, but that's against the Caliph. And I can't press a claim against the Caliph, even though he's in a weakened position right now. In the middle of the night, I seclude myself in the room I have meticulously prepared for tonight's black magic. With every step of the ritual completed, the air in the room grows more and more oppressing until finally I sense that I am about to unleash a being of terrible power upon my unsuspecting foe. Please be possessed so I can unholily impregnate you and have a daughter, an unholy daughter. Again, instead of like the uh, one that was sent to China to join the Chinese court with her husband. So I do have two weak claims. And the other claim is against a land in Jaws, though. I don't... Oh, wait a minute. It's on behalf of a land in Claim Karakum. And this is just against the heir of Distan. I have learned that Caliph II has started to plot to kill Ganab Bent Zimmon. A little... Um, it does not concern me. Let it be. Where is Karakum? It's not down to the south, is it? The ritual was a round, resounding success. My kinswoman is amendable to my suggestions. She is, however, insane. So now I will try to induct into Lucifer's own, and if she joins, she will be the first woman I ever successfully inducted into Lucifer's own. Well, my guests has yet to understand the true nature of the world the rich the right methods of persuasion might get through to her not many survive the long journey to the truth but few can bear it once reveal once it is revealed to them but she would be an asset to our ranks leave us alone guard do not return until first light the ritual was a resounding success she seems to have taken quite a liking to me and is now far more amenable to my suggestions. The unfortunate side effect is she's become quite obviously insane, exactly as planned. Okay, that's a repeat of the loyal servant feature. Now, where's Kara come? Well, she has not been quite the same since she truly awoke. Her mind is less broken than it is before. The light no longer blinds you, my dear sister. Uh, my uh, induction attempt is finally successful. Ariman welcomes part of Vignal Jaws into the coven. Uh, Pertinval leaves Lucifer's own society. Pertinval joins Lucifer's own society. All right, so now I will unholy impregnation. Abjur Pertival gladly accepted my proposal. I could never imagine a greater honor, brother, she told me as we were about to begin the summoning. Kneeling on the floor and holding each other's hands, we began to chant the magic words. As the stranger entered, I squeezed her fingers and departed. And so it is done. Now I can only await the impending birth. So I will... Uh, my brother in darkness uh, thought we should stage an impromptu orgy in honor of Ariman. What a lovely idea. Now I will declare war, claim Kara come. 
on light. There it is, it's just to the north. And I'll get using these mercenaries once once again. I can't think of all those prisoners in my dungeon, the panic in their eyes. Oh, I, geez, this guy likes to torture people quite a bit. Even the Crusader Kings too. And I'll lay low to try to avoid being found out as a uh, Satan's own. And now that the battle is on, we'll try to siege down Karakum. It seems like the, my black magic was successful, however the result was not quite what I imagined. I had hoped the miserly fool Amir and Najab would be stricken by a mysterious case of pox or plague, but it turns out my spell only gave him syphilis, so I didn't kill him. Uh, I will lay low as they're rounding up members of Lucifer's own. I cannot believe it, dearest Gerasmos. My humble lord, you are gone from this world and I am left behind, alone and heartbroken. I will never hold you in my arms again. I do not know what to do with these unbearable feelings. I will seek solace in your grave. Not another tear. No longer shall I let myself be ruled by my feelings. Oh, I'll seek solace in your grave. Why not? What could go wrong? Thanks to Ohura Maza's great mercy, there were no other visitors at Garrus, Garrus Moth's grave. When I arrived, he spent several hours, mere yards from his cold body, contemplating the fragility of life and love. When I returned to my chambers, as if by a sign sent from Garrus Moth, I found his lucky charm on the floor. I shall cher cherish it till the day I die. Oh, I gain health 50%. That's pretty good. Now let's get to Karakum, and I will lay low as they've... Uh, got yet another member of Super Zone, and people are less suspicious of all my powers of being a son of the devil. Oh, I've only got three months to end my conflicts, as the Caliph has decreed a uh, realm peace. Uh, the corruption crept on me slowly, I did not realize what was happening to me before it was too late. Now dark tendrils of Aruman's magic have invaded my body, sapping my energy and causing all sorts of aches and ailments. I cannot for the last I cannot remember the last day when I was not sniveling, coughing, or retching. And I get magical corruption until eighteen fifty eight, giving me negative two health. And that's quite the can I dark heal? And I can't go into dark healing either. Okay, so I've got to win this war for Kara Come. That's 53% war score. And I think I siege down his castle, so that should be the most difficult one to take as well. I'll just wait till my... Oh, this one's going down 30% every 12 days. A daughter was born to a land in Alelg. This is my granddaughter. All right, I will give her duty again and assign her a guardian with high and see if I can marry her. News from China, intending to enforce their subjugation as a tributary state of the Tang Empire, the Protector General Wang of the Western Protectorate has declared war upon Burga. Han armies are already marching towards the realm of uh, Kagan Burga, and it seems possible that his that this spells the end of the Burgan did independence. May their gods protect them. And anyone with any good? Yes, I'll torture another prisoner. He keeps asking me that. She's uh, this guy is quick. And why am I just raiding? Oh, okay, 100% war score. I can't stop thinking of all the prisoners in my dungeon. Ah, oh, 
I missed realm peace by just moments. I had a 100% war score. I was about to hit it. And I missed realm peace because I had the uh, game speed turned up too high. Uh, oh, wait a minute. It's got zero. So what war is this? This is the Caliph. Oh, there's two Caliphs. The Sultan of Arabia, Africa, and Egypt versus my liege, the Sultan, the Caliph, of the Arabian Empire. Now, is there anyone outside of the empire that I could attack? This uh, Zabulistan and Malhalad. Oh, and this has joined Mulholland. So that's why I can't... Is this my liege? Or no, this is the Sultan of Arabia. This is a different... Um... So, the Sheikdom of Kabar. Which one is Kabar? Border dispute over Galan. Or actually, can I make. No, I can't. I don't have claims on Bajanid anymore. Uh, where? Where is K Bar? Oh, I should learn to spell K H A Y B A R K H A Y. K H A Y B A R Sheikdom of K Bar. Oh, okay. Oh, no. That's in Mal Halibid. I can't declare war because he's not independent. That would be going to war with the Caliph, who has 9,000 troops. Uh. Is there anything? Can I transfer my... So 57 months. I'm losing 18 gold a month by keeping these. Uh, by keeping these mercenaries on retainer. Can I conquer the Sultan? He's got nothing. Can I conquer him? Declare war. I don't have a Casas belly. I lost all these claims suddenly. Uh, so I guess I should, with great reluctance, 23, with great reluctance, I will dismiss or can I dismiss it? Looks like I have two companies. Can I dismiss half of them? Um, Bedouin company. I didn't mean to split them. Arab company. Uh, Arab company. Arab company. So which of these? This is 1608. Okay, these are... They both look like they're composed almost identically. So, um, Quivirian army. We'll disband the unit. Now, that will give me half my monthly cost. And is that something I can pay? Ah, uh, all right, all right already. I will torture someone else. And that gives me a balance of negative 18. The ruler war declaration sovereignty law. So I'm only losing seven gold pieces now per month because I don't hold any trading post or I do hold the trading post of Gurgan in my capital again. I should check to see what state it's in. Uh, it's still pretty good. It's a level 2 trading post. Um, dare I start spending money to increase the total trade value? Plus 10. 
finally it is here. Pertabel went into labor last night and early this morning little Riza was born. He seems strong and healthy even though only time can reveal what powers his demon blood has granted him. I anticipate great things to come. My kinsman Riza Jaws. Great, he's a male of my line. For some reason he's imprisoned by me. Um, I'll let him out of prison. And he's a cannibal. Oh no, I'm a cannibal and no murderer. Um, Hail Ariman, I have. Now, if only I could make him my hair. Uh, I'll send him a gift. And I can't really train him. I'll release him from prison. What's his religion? Great, he's Zoroastrian. He's Persian. He's male. He can hold titles. Uh, I will release him from prison. Hopefully he won't kill all the rest of my children. Um, now I will assign a guardian to him. Uh, I'll try to give him... Uh, should I give him high intrigue? Because I have a feeling that's where he's going to end up anyway. So we'll assign him the highest intrigue even though I can't choose a focus for him. And uh, I'll just set him up as a special interest child. And I'm tempted to demonically possess him um, so that he doesn't kill off my entire family. Ah, oh, and I was so close to winning Kara come. Yeah, I've lost all the... Uh, lost all the sieging from Karakum and and Gurgan did I did I decide to yes I will spend the 200 gold to increase the trading in that province and my chancellor is working away currently in Quivir to tech I move them to Gurgan to collect taxes Get him scheming. And my MOBAD will research cultural tech. And I guess I'll put him here. I'm not even sure if researching cultural tech. I'll have to look that up in the Crusader 2's wiki. If uh, if researching cultural tech by your MOBAD does you any good while well, you're actually in your own kingdom. Or if he has to be abroad. And I'll... Uh, make this gentleman uh, and put him into the capital try to keep him happier and my marshal is there someone my marshal is a strong uh, he's negative 77 but he wants a seat on the council I don't see these mayors as particularly powerful or capable of uh, causing a rebellion. So I'll keep them aside. Oh, I need a court physician. Can I get one from China? Oh, I'll torture someone again. Uh, I'll request a Chinese physician. They've decided to send me Fai Shea, who is uh, 25 learning. Sounds like a great physician, 10 diplomacy. Now, can I marry him matrilineally to someone in my household? Yes, I can. So I can try to get that learning and that uh, talent into my line of Jawses. Uh, that's excellent. And I now have a good court position. He's automatically appointed. Yes, he is. Now, designated regent. Um, I could appoint Glitterhoof. Uh, oh, you can appoint women as regent. I didn't realize that. Uh, this, a land and elg didn't turn out, at least for my family, to be totally horrible. Even though he's slow. If he hadn't been slow, he would have been pretty good. I'm attempted to make she, the court physician, my 
Jemaliah. Jemaliah is strong at 68, and I'll make her the designated regent. Maybe she won't conspire against me. And can I still request an artifact? No. Uh, what can I do to Orm? I can send a gift. Lose 500 gold. No, I don't have that kind of money to spare at the moment. And I'm still there, uh, losing 7 balance. Well, I guess I'm going to just speed things up. The plot to kill Caliph Hussein II is proceeding well. Oh, I... In a fit of pique, I decided to join all these plots. Uh, my loyal vassal, I recently received some disturbing allegations against you from Ejir Emir Najab of the Hashemid Emirate. I do not believe them, but you should know that he is no friend of yours. All right, well, we'll end the episode there. I uh, tried and failed to get Kara come back to my uh, patrimony. Uh, it came to within me literally clicking on the 100% war score button before a realm peace was decided, but I didn't get a uh, click onto that uh, character portrait, so I lost Karakum. And currently I am trying to uh, attack the site exterior to the Empire that I can handle down here in Zabulistan. And what I did manage to, to do, though, is the birth of my demon child of a uh, demon child of the House of Jaws. I'm not sure if he's my son or nephew or what his actual relationship is to me. He doesn't show up as one of my children. Uh, the last demon child killed off half my children, the daughter, before she finally went to China. So I'm not sure what this demon child is going to do to uh, the remainder of my family, even though I'm head of Lucifer's own. So uh, that's where we sit, sit on the uh, road back to Zoroastrianism and the uh, road to rebuilding. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you have, just click the uh, subscribe button and the bell so you get notification of my new videos and have a good day.